Hey guys, in this video we're going to be looking at replacing all instances of a string within another string and we're going to be looking at a way to do it without using the replace all method and without using a regular expression. Now the reason we're looking at doing it without using the replace all method is because you may have already seen down here I'm getting an error when I'm trying to use the replace all method and that error is the replace all is not a function. So this replace all method was introduced in a later version of ECMAScript. I can't remember which version. However, there's particular node versions. I think it's from version 12 and down. I may be wrong on that, but I think it's from version 12 and down in node where it's using an older version of ECMAScript. Therefore, we cannot use this replace all function because it doesn't exist. And for example, I'm running this in a Next.js application. So this bit of code here. This little util function I've created is running server side in the compilation process for this Next.js project. So we can see the error in the console here, but if we take a look in the browser as well, we can see it. HTML string dot replace all is not a function. So there's actually a really simple way around this and that is using string split. And I promise you this tutorial will be over in just a split second. So all we need to do is instead of using the replace all method on our string, so this HTML string is of type string, we can use our string variable dot split. So this will split it into an array based on a separator. So the separator we're going to give it is the string that we want replaced. And instead of passing a second argument, where in the replace all function, the second argument is what we're going to replace the string with. We can just join that string back again with what we want to replace this first string with. So if I save this now and take a look in the browser, I can see I'm not getting any errors. I'm not getting any errors in my console either. And that is the super simple way without regular expression and without the replace all method to replace all instances of a string in another string.